Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Um, today I want to talk about deworming. I want to talk about deworming. Why it's important to deworm your beds. Why it's important to deworm your beds. That's what I want to talk about. Nison Passi is my name, former full-time varsity lecturer, corporate trainer, and team building consultant. Very passionate about poultry farming. Um, I would like to talk about something new that is deworming and why it's very important to deworm. But before I proceed, don't forget to subscribe to your channel, Tuyen Farms, by hitting that button so that next time you'll be the first one to know. Why should you deworm your beds? It's very important that you deworm your beds regularly. You must deworm them regularly. First thing, how do you know that your chickens need deworming? How do you know that your, chick your chickens need deworming? That's the question. Now if you look at my bed here, there are symptoms which you see from your beds Okay, number one, like for example, these are layer beds, they free range. Okay, now I put my camera in such a way that you are able to see their main housing, this one, and that compartment there. But where I'm standing, it's a free range area where they play. They play in an open area, so because of that, I need to deworm my bed. How do I know that they need DNA? The symptoms are as follows. Number one, you find that there are worms in the droppings. You need to take a closer look at the droppings. Okay, every time they drop their poo, take a closer look at the droppings. You might see some worms there. Now, that is one indication or one symptom. Number two, you find that there are worms in the eggs, like these are layers. There may be worms in the egg. So you break the egg, you check inside the egg, you might find that there are small worms there. That's number two. Number three, you find that the droppings are abnormal. That is abnormal droppings. How do you know that the ab let me turn my bed here. Okay, you find that your chicken has got diarrhea. Okay, that's one. Diarrhea as well as foamy looking poopoo. Foamy looking poopoo or poo. That is another indication. Then you also find that there is weight loss. It's another indication. Weight loss. Then the other thing is dirty vent feathers dirty vent feathers you find that here the vent there is dirty here wettish like it could be an indication your beds need deworming the other thing is that there is a throat gasping okay throat gasping you find your chickens doing something like when they are breathing okay gasping for air that's throat gasping it's a sign that they need deworming and also head stretching they might stretch their head right like stretching their head it's another sign that your beds need deworming okay then the ultimate symptom is sudden death that's the ultimate sudden death you might find that your chickens they have got you know sudden death so those are some of the symptoms they are not exhaustive of course 
so when you see any one of those signs it's very important you contact your veterinary doctor okay then you check with your vet doctor who will recommend to you now the medication i'm not a veterinary doctor let me put a disclaimer remember i said you call your veterinary doctor for advice the medication it depends with the type of worm there are so many types of worms we talk of round worm we talk of uh, we talk of uh, tapeworm we talk of slugs we talk of um, other types of worms you know so it depends with the type of worm and each type of worm requires a specific medication though generally we use uh, peprazine um, to deworm some type of worms require a different kind of medication so consult your vet doctor for the best medication okay how should you avoid um, um, worms in your poultry of course the fundamental one is that keep your housing clean make sure that your pot is always clean right you must always regularly clean your poultry house secondly change the like for example let me take a look at this the feeders okay make sure that the feeders are clean they are clean regularly so make sure you clean your feeders your drinkers change them clean them regularly and um, foot bath is very important in my previous video i showed you the importance of foot bath there's a foot bath right here next to me okay foot bath for disease control it's very important don't allow people into your poultry house so that your poultry house is free of diseases and you must make sure that you feed your chickens regularly elimination of stress chickens do not like stress the moment they are stressed then they are susceptible to diseases so eliminate stress like this type of bed which i keep the bosch veld african bed very sturdy very strong they don't like stress they like flying they like to be free if you keep them in house there they won't be free and they won't mate enough the roosters will not mount on the females but the moment you open the gate for them to free range here they will do a perfect job the roosters will start to mount on the females and you can see that they are happy you know there is joy among the birds so you must make sure you eliminate stress that's the story about deworming okay so guys before i forget don't forget to subscribe to your channel tuyen farms so that next time i post another video you'll be the first one to know good morning